Okay, let's do this thing, calling all ghouls. Come out and meet your maker. Fim, thank you very much. Black Bloodleaf. Huh, first time I've seen that. <laughs> yeah. Actually, you know, for a melee character, I shouldn't joke. Rolling paints actually kick ass. They really do. For an early weapon, yeah. Mod it up with some, some spikes and whatnot. Yeah, they really kick butt. For a, you know, I shouldn't joke. They just look so ridiculous, you know. Especially when you're dressed up in power armor, you know. You look like you're faking. I knew it. Here's another faker. We roamers get two shots. How about you, you faking? Yeah. What? Who? Oh shit! That's enough out of you. She's letting me know you're down there. Okay, I've never gone on this boat before. Here we go. This is creepy crawly city. Oh my gosh, okay. Fuck, okay. But what did we get this time? A bolstering treated leather chest piece grants increasing energy and damage resistance to lower your health. I hate these. But the only use I could see for those is creating a tank build and then like, you know, planning to be consistently below or in low health so that you can constantly use the, the benefits of the, uh, but other than that, it's like, you know, legendaries made for losers. <laughs> you know what I'm you're complete and I'm not. You can't shoot and you're always in low health. We're going to help you out a little bit here, okay? This is made just for you. Okay, let's go inside the tannery and take care of business. Where's my marker? Can I go in here? Hold up here. Slow down there, big boy. Yeah, let's go in the front door. I believe we're going to come up here afterwards. Ouch. Jeez, he gave me cooties. Yeah, that's where we're gonna come out. Somebody's creepy crawling around in there. Okay, we got yours, death. Alright, let's do this. Can't go there. Oh my gosh. Oh, Psycho Buff is worn out. Let's take a little more. Orange Man Test is worn out. Let's take a little more. And I believe I'm out of Med X. Let's just double check this here. No, no, we got one more. Nice shoot you got no, I got zero chance. Is there anything I could shoot in there to open the door? We got a safe there. I see a weapon there too. It's like an auto shotgun and some money in the safe, okay. So I never put points into lock picking, so 
Oh man, it's creepy crawling all over the map. Okay. I knew I got these guys dead. To, oh, here we got another legendary. Yeah, even though I got these guys dead, dead to rights, I'm a creepy crawly right up in your face. It's like, you know. Okay, let me grab this. What's this? Poisoner's Combat Armor Left Leg. Plus 25 poison resistance, alright. How about a legendary, like, the legendary bonus attribute fixer? Plus 25% better chance of getting better legendaries. <laughs> huh? Okay, we got a clipping problem here. Oh, he flew. 540 McTwist, alright. And there's nothing up here. I came up here in before. This is just like a toolbox. Grab that. Okay, I'm creeped out. Okay, we gotta go down to the basement and get the power tools. Oh yeah, the glowing one. So make sure you got some crits left. Let's swap over to the, the big gun. There's the glowing one. A couple of head crits for you. Well, okay, just one. <laughs> Get the tannery key off him, grab all his stuff. And the tools are right here. Grab those up. What did Mr. Red Chest give us? A glow sighted, calibrated, powerful combat rifle. Jeez, that's pretty good actually. Doesn't fit in with my build, but it's pretty good. And I'm carrying too much. Okay, let's just grab all this and then we'll dump all the leather stuff because that's the crappy. The crappy crap. Okay, give me a moment here. Don't these things just crack you right up? This is the finest in Far Harbor evening wear. The Lobster Trap Helmet! <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna keep one of those as a souvenir too. Okay, let's go, I'm ready. Grab, oh great, some Med-X and some buff out, and we're good. The key that we just grabbed off, the glowing one, should left out this door here. That's where we were before. And um, before you do that, you might want to put on your business suit. Why slack? Because we're gonna do a lot of business. I want to rename that business suit so it's easier to find. And um, black rim glasses and the dapper gent. That should put my charisma up to nine. Indeed, it does. And we have to win an orange check. So I think maybe a beer will do it. Do we have a beer? Yes, we do. All right, let's go. Oh my gosh! I forgot. This is, you gotta take care of some legendaries first. I even had notes on this. Okay, uh. Ouch! Yeah, I'm wet. Uh... Okay, that's a regular fog ghoul. Take care of him. There's definitely a legendary here, though. Here we go. Let me get him. Let me get him. And there's. Hold up! I've been casing those ghouls for weeks. Shady Mike. Wait for an opening, and you dive in and choppy chop, bang bang, and the whole lot of them dead. You even know what you got right there? A premium set of 
Pelman's power tools. Is that right? Okay, hang on. Let me just put on my business suit and check out my legendary. A resolute time slows down for a moment when clamoring when chambering the final round in the magazine. Huh. First time I ever seen one of these. Must try. Wow, interesting. All right. Okay, hang on there, Mike. I just want to put on my business suit. Uh, hopefully, I'm still under the under the influence. Yep. Okay. Speak. Excuse me. Hold up. I've been casing those ghouls for weeks. Waiting for an opening, and you dive in, and choppy chop, bang bang, and the whole lot of them, dead. You even know what you got right there? A premium set of Pelman's power tools. Oh, how about that? Tools With are the shape of the world right now, tools like this are useful. Exactly. You got it. Wait. Oh, Marina sent you, didn't she? Goddamn Mitch and his big mouth. No matter what she's offering, it's nothing. Serious builders would give an arm for them tools. I'll pay you 2,000 caps right here, right now. Deal? Okay, now it's unclear whether it's a bug if you accept this or um, it's intended to be. But if you accept the... Uh, I'm going to go for the reward anyways. I just want the XP. Tools in a condition like this, they're positively unique. Maybe I should auction them off someplace. Mm. 2750. Say yes now before I change my mind. Okay, now if you do sell the tools to Machete Guy, Machete Guy, Machete Mike, you'll fail. Um, I'll show you the quest. I can't show you now, but you're going to fail the quest where you're supposed to help the Mariner. And you also won't be able to do the Hull Breach 2 and Hull Breach 3 quest. Now, you could also kill him. You could, like, reject the offer and then kill him. That is. Um, I'll talk about that in a minute. I'm just gonna reject the offer and leave him alone. I'll pass on the offer. I ain't hanging around forever. Walk away from this, and you'll regret it. Okay, um, I'll tell you what, let's just hope this doesn't bugger things up. Here's one thing you can do. If you just want the money, you don't really care. Kill him. Alright? And then you can grab all his caps. Right, that's one way to do that. I don't want to do that though. If you do do that, what will happen is uh, once you get back to town, a lot of people have reported this. Okay, you turn in Hull Breach, and then um, the Mariner won't talk to you ever again to give you Hull Breach Two and Hull Breach Three quests. Although other people have said that they have managed to kill Machine Mike and still get the Hull Breach Two and Hull Breach Three quests, so it's completely up in the air whether this is a bug. Or if this is something that we have yet to discover about how to trigger the next quest in the Hull Breach quest line and still kill Machete Mike. Uh, other people say uh, you can pickpocket him, attempt to pickpocket him, and that will turn him hostile. And then once he's hostile, you can safely kill him and then continue with the Hull Breach quest line. Uh, on the wiki, it says that's inconsistent, it doesn't always work. I'm just gonna leave him alone. I'm just gonna leave him alone. You can keep your money, Mike. Because I want to do the other two quests. Other people have reported even still. This happened to me too. And by the way, um, the bug where you kill Mike and then um, you go back to the Mariner and you're not able to continue the Hope Reach quest line, I can confirm that. Okay, that actually happened to me. I also can confirm that I was unable to continue the Hope Reach quest line, even leaving Machete Mike. A lie, but I found a way around that. And there's enemies nearby. Who? It's not you. You're not hostile. My offer for them tools won't stay open forever. Yeah, I know. Doesn't he remind you of uh, what's that guy in The Simpsons? Diamond Joe Quimby. Okay, now we can pass travel. This long on the island. Okay, everything's wearing off. Let's go talk to the Mariner first. 
You been to the tannery? You find my tools yet? Yep. Here are your tools. A fair bit of luck running into you. Here's your reward. Well earned. And now to work on the hull. There you go, 450 caps. Hope is complete. Then the doctor comes running up to you as soon as you complete that. Your doc. There you go. You are a curious specimen. Despite our friendly town doing its best to chase you out, you keep helping us ingrates all the same. I got to ask, why do you keep at it? Well, what do you say there, Lucky? I help mainly for the caps. Yeah, huh? that's, that's about it. What was that? Oh, <laughs> caps, huh? Make some money and help at the same time. Respectful. Most folk here are set in their ways, yes? It makes no difference how hard you try to get in good with them. Heck, it took my family three generations before the Daltons would sell us a heel of bread. But there's a way. A downright insane way, mind you. You can turn even the most stubborn fool around. All right. How? I'd love to change their opinion of me. Do it right. And all mainlanders might get treated better. In olden times, leaders were chosen by something called the Captain's Dance. Legends say the toughest meanest and outright craziest hopefuls would chum the waters and lure out the worst the island could throw at them. Once the would-be captain killed the Myrler Queen, or Fog Crawler, or what have you, they'd invite the whole island to feast off the bounty. You do this, well, you won't be made captain, but you'll earn respect. Everyone's respect. I'm ready to become a legend then. You what? <laughs> you crack me up. There's an old Meyer Lurk feasting grounds by Emmett's Causeway. A treacherous stretch along the coast. Go there and throw any kind of meat you got into the water. All that blood and viscera will be sure to attract attention. And then wait. I'll make sure there's a witness or two. Prove to the rest of these clods you belong. Okay, we got the rite of passage quest. Drop meat in the water and... Him back. Take on the Loch Ness monster. Um, <laughs> you ain't long for this. That's, this should complete the uh, that quest where we're supposed to help all the locals there living on the edge. There we go. That is now complete. We've officially helped all the locals in the town of Far Harbor. Tell you what, let's do some selling. Business suit is still on. Um, time for a little bit of great men tats. And a beer. Gear for trade? Show me what you got. Let's deal. Let's. Hope you get some harpoons. Atta boy. Big batch of them, too. I us take some fusion sale ammo. What the hell? Okay. Bingo. Perfect. Alright, Brooks. You open the business. You need. Stranger, you need odds, hands, junk, or knickknacks. You've come to the right place. Let's deal. Of course. All right, let's take a look at your junk. Don't take that the wrong way. What did I do? <laughs> Mr. Fumblefingers is all over this business session. Sorry. You need more? Hey you know, when I'm feeling down, down Lord knows she's always, always carrying on about something. Up. Stand in one place, numbat, numbat. Get them while they're in stock. Excuse me. Psst. Looking for a bargain? Let's barter. Of course. You have harpoons too. Great. Here, that'll work. Soul to man called Brooks. I don't have time for you. My gosh. The hell? What? You. Only Alan's got enough backbone to stand up to the children. Okay. A little sweet on Alan, eh? Alright, and that is it. Let me just go back to uh, the homestead and fix powder my nose. Drop off a few things.
In goes the junk. That'll work. And I forgot to turn in the mission uh, for Cassie Dalton. By my guns. Cassie Dalton is down this way. Food. Stim packs. Holy stuff. Grandpa George can rest in peace. The fog crawler is dead. <clears throat> Wonderful. That's another chapter successfully concluded. You truly are the heroic Avenger I hoped you were. With that fog crawler gone, we can send some folks up there to get the place ready for you. That's right. The farm is yours. Boy. Your own little piece of the island. Okay. It'll take work to get it up and running again, but you'll have help. And here's another 200 caps in gratitude for your service to the great Dalton lineage. 200 caps? Surely a heroic Avenger deserves more than... Yeah. I can agree to that. Here's another hundred caps. Now, I don't have to tell you that the bonds of blood and family are strong. As strong as any a person can know. But if you ask me, the strongest among them is the bond that exists between two married people. That's why the last part of this tale is the hardest one for me to tell. Okay. Yeah, I take it this is the next chapter of the story. It's the final chapter, in fact. My late husband, Daniel, was the best fisherman this island ever saw. He and his crew had a favorite fishing spot out by Brooks Head Lighthouse. One day, a day I'll never forget, I see Danny's boat pulling up with his crewmen all shouting and carrying on. Turns out some trappers moved into the lighthouse. No doubt because the island told them to. They're all crazier than a bag of mole rats. A bag of mole rats, I love it. Having a little target practice. Shot Danny right between the eyes. Killed him, just like that. You go and get that son of a bitch. You make him pay for doing the island's bidding. Okay, where is this lighthouse? How do I get to the Brookshead Lighthouse? It's southwest of town. Not far from the quarry. Alright, how about a little sassafras? Wait, did you just call someone else crazy? That is priceless. What? <laughs> I don't get your meaning. Ugh, never that mind. is pretty funny. <laughs> Remember, trappers may be half crazy from the fog, but they still know how to use a gun. Okay, so we got the final chapter of uh, Blood Tide. When the fog rolled in. Fight, we're doing a walk through here. And um, let's go see if things have advanced with the Hull Breach quest. No, they haven't. Otherwise, there'd be spikes here. Um, so this is what I was saying. This might be bugged out as well. Good I can do with those tools. If that's all she Marin. says. All manner of good I can do with those tools. I can't know how to fix this. Your loved ones with my Cause I left Machete kids. Mike alive, so there should be no bug. Let's put on a combat gear and just simply run a fair distance away. From town and then back again. That should fix it. Fast traveling away doesn't doesn't fix it, as you just saw. So typically I run down the street here to that little toll gate thingy. I'm not sure if you have to go this far, but this is what I did in practice for us to fix this. There we go, that I'll do it. Fast travel back. Alright, let's turn around and check it out. There we go, the spikes have been erected. That means we can now push on to the next stage in the Hull Breach quest. The Mariner should now talk to us. You found her a joy to work there we go. With. It gave me this idea. Okay, what's that? A cargo that? freighter founded ages ago. Uh -huh. To the south. With a bit of arc welding and some elbow grease, the hull could be reinforced to be sturdy. Fierce. Best to do it soon. Before. Well, soon. Okay, where did we get this so-called elbow grease that you speak of? 
<laughs> uh, okay, um, why so soon? Why does it need to be soon? I... That's not a matter for you. Just... The hole needs fixing. Yeah, the plot thickens. Sounds like a really good plan. The ship's the MS Azalea. Expect trappers, mean ones. I don't mean Once that. you mop the decks with them, I'll send my crew over. Best of luck. Thank you. Alright, so we have our standing orders. Final chapter of Blood Tide and Hope Reach 2. That's coming up next video. Uh, for now, I'm going to call it. And I'd like to thank you all very much for watching. And for say man. goodbye, Lucky. Goodbye, all Lucky. And, and if you thought this video was remotely entertaining and or informative, please subscribe to my channel to get more videos like this. Hot off the press. All right. See you next video.